introducing our new giveaway car. This 2016 GT350 we already had set up for you guys with a Hellion Twin Turbo Kit and Weld Wheels. Not only that, we're gonna give you $15,000 on top of that. All you have to do to enter one of this car is go to 1320video.com. Every dollar you spend is one entry to win this car in 15 grand cash. James Kemp out here with the outlawed all-wheel drive Honda Civic. You were really fast with your old car years ago and had a bad wreck a couple of years ago. Rebuilt the car last year. We saw you run it last year, but it was quite a bit slower. Mainly because of the weight, right? Yeah, we just started out at lower power on a 76 mil turbo and yep. more weight. Just to, I, I needed to get comfortable back in the car again, right? Like all wheel drive, but we had the fears of the crash stuff and all that that you got to work through. So we decided to like just slowly work it in over the course of the year with the new car instead of just trying to go nuts again. Yeah, right just a little shakedown session. Yeah. We decided to start putting some power into it now. We've been, you know, spend a lot of time with the chassis, suspension, clutch, you know, all the stuff to get the ET and get efficiency out of it, not just power. So. We kind of focus more on that side of it this year, and now we're working power in right at the tail end of this year, starting to up the power. How big is the turbo on the car now? Right now it's on an 86. So, so quite a bit bigger. Yep. Oh, yeah. yep about how much power is it making with that turbo? Uh, we're around the 2,000 horse range again, about what we were with the old car. <laughs> What's the engine in here? It's a two-liter V-series. It's a two-liter displacement. Yep. That's yep. nuts. So you're, you were how much weight last year? It was 2,500 pounds here last year. It's 2,400 right now. Okay. But we're thinking about spraying it now, maybe. <laughs> That'd be cool. Uh, so what do you think it'll go? Our, our best pass previous to this was a few months ago. It was a 704 at the same mile an hour at 202 back home. So you've been 70s. Yeah, a lot of 70s. Yeah. And we've had the eighth to go six many, many times at this point now. It's always something in fourth gear that, that happens. And what transmission is in the car? It's got a PPG four speed. So it's a yeah, it's B series like Honda CRV transmission with our bill and bell housing and transfer case, and then PPG internal set of weight track differential. Uh, and transfer case stuff is also the PPG internals. Lots of speed factory parts. Yeah, I mean, we put a lot into developing the B series stuff because we knew it could make the power, but the drivetrain stuff didn't really exist to be able to go this far with it. So we spent the last two, three years with uh, Jason's car, the four door, developing all the parts to be able to do it, improving it out with his car, and then using it on this, on this one. Yeah. Beautiful. You've held the Honda stick shift record for a while now, right? Yep. The yep. 706 is currently what it is. Uh, yeah, it was 70. Four, and then Red Demon's got a 698. Eight. Got a 698, yep. And of course, six is on your mind this weekend. Oh, yeah. What sure. do you think it's going to take to do that? Well, we just need a clean pass. We, we've done everything we need to do the eighth and then some. Like to go deep six, right? We've done it plenty of times in the eighth. We just haven't got it all to come together. Clean pass. So that's really what we're hoping for here is to just get a solid pass all the way down. And we know the six will happen. And this is the place to do it. You know, yeah, it absolutely. usually comes together for a lot of teams here. Yeah, we tried hard to do it earlier. It got close. We're like, oh, this is the race to the sixes. And Devin got it done. Awesome. Congrats to them. Yep. We did not get it done. We tried. We tried our hardest, and it just did not happen for us. So it would be great to do it here in front of everyone. That makes it like it, it feels more special to do it here than at home. So it's amazing. Yeah. We got one hell of a car here. It's going to be a great weekend of World Cup finals. Good luck in the rest of qualifying, man. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Sixes on 24 and a half is like our big thing. 
like trying to do that on the small, like you know, to do that on the higher this small. Yeah. Is Definitely. Looking amazing. Huge challenge. Nice work, man. And no spray, they were saying. Yeah. No nitrous in the car. It wasn't a full hit. Wanted it to be a full hit. Yeah. Unintentionally. Yeah, you were down like 20 mile an hour almost. About 1,100 feet. It just nosed over super hard. So I, I think it blew a charge back. As soon as I clutched in, it was running fine. It felt fine. So I, I'm guessing that's what happened. First Honda H pattern. I think maybe the quickest four cylinder right now. Yeah. Devin's a 90, 98. 98. Damn. So, yeah, we we'll see what you do tonight. Yeah. Congrats, man. Go celebrate. Speed Factory in the house out here at World Cup Finals, breaking records. The first Honda H pattern in the sixes. Incredible. And not even a full pass. They were down about 10 mile an hour on that one. They're hoping to spray tonight. We might be we might be seeing six eighties. Second passes would be epic. On to the third round. Yes, sir. Made it consistent just in time for eliminations here. Yeah. Yeah. But you know how you're racing next round? Um, nope. Not sure. All right. Not sure. All, all that matters, you're going yep. back up there. Yep. You making any big changes? Nope. Nope. Just going to run it back. All right. Good yep. luck, man. James up here for the semifinal race against the GA Stroke. It was a second difference in qualifying time, so anything can happen at drag racing. Let's see how this race goes in the semifinal round. Coleman in the S10 cracked his head, is not going to make up for the final, but James is going to make a full pass here, so let's see what he runs on this last pass at World Cup Finals.
one hell of a performance for James and the Speed Factory team this weekend, running the first six H pattern Honda in the world and taking home $10,000 in the finals right there. That's going to do it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time.